Well, quarter two is almost over, so why don't you join us and come and take a look around the farm and see what we've been up to. In quarter two, we've been carving and joining. We had a KPI of three to three and a half condition score. The cows have been three and a half to four all through. It's been more of a challenge to stop them getting too fat this year than it has been to keep the feed up to them. We've had a pretty uneventful calving with no major issues, which is always a welcome relief. Our bulls have gone out a week earlier than they have done in past years. We've done this with a view to bringing our calving forward to make better use of our spring flush. We've been moving the cows and calves regularly in a four paddock rotation. Their feed on offer has been 24 to 2600 kilograms of dry matter per hectare. We've been lucky enough to be able to make plenty of silage and hay this year, although there's been some long nights involved. One of the changes we are making this year is to sell some of our excess fodder to increase our income. With that in mind, we have bailed anything that was surplus to our needs. We've done this not only for the income but also to manipulate the pasture growth to enable fresh feed to be on offer. A lot of the hay has been sold locally into the dairy market but some has gone farther afield too. Our contracting business is very important, so at the, at the moment I'm down in southern Victoria bailing. We've sown a summer crop this year of millet, some has gone into dry land paddocks, others also gone into irrigation, which should ensure plentiful feed right throughout summer. We were lucky enough a couple of weeks ago to have 45 mil of rain, which has certainly benefited all the pastures, but in particular the lucerne. This lucerne was cut 21 days ago now. We were lucky enough to get 45 mil of rain on it um, three days after it was bailed. So consequently we've got some very good regrowth and are likely to get another cut in probably another two to three weeks if the weather flows the game. We've just started watering our summer crop to achieve our goal of 10,000 kilograms of dry matter to the hectare. While there's a bit of work, there's also a bit of fun involved for the kids in the water. And most importantly, all of us here at Edo hope you have Merry Christmas! Happy New Year!